You begin your hunt for the Jedi Orb while in Checkpoint Rest Town and it begins automatically while wandering around by talking with a Falv. Say, you wouldn't happen to have seen a pretty stone to have stolen from me while I... There's no exaggeration, to be quite truthful. Working under a man such as him, I, unless... Unless... The Jedi Orb could be anywhere now. Perchance we ought to speak with someone who has experience in banditry. If you head further into the town while you're here, you'll also be spoken to by Everard, who's also looking for the Jedi Orb. Now, you can give the Orb to either of these people and get different rewards. However, there is a way to get both rewards, and we're going to go over that, and that is by faking the Orb once we've found it. So we will have two copies of it. Let's take a look at how to do that. First to find the orb, head to the jail in Vernworth, and this part is optional, you don't have to go here, I will show you it in the video though. You head here as part of the main story as well, and inside the jail in one of the cells is a man who you can bribe for 500 coins, and he tells you the orb's location. He mentions it's located in Ibrahim's scrap shop back in Rest Town, and as I mentioned you don't have to go to the jail, you can simply head to the scrap shop, and you should already be in Rest Town. So head to the shop and you can buy the orb, it will cost 7,000 gold. Welcome sir. Contrary to the name, this little shop of mine deals in naught but the finest treasures. If you think me a liar, then buy something and see the truth for yourself. Now one of the cool things about the vendor is he can duplicate your items for money and one of the items you can duplicate is the orb and so you can do that for 2000 gold. I shall have your order crafted in good time a little Wait a few days in game and your orb and the fake are ready to be picked up. You are, sir. Use it well. So now you have two orbs, who do you give them to? Well, you need to give the real orb to Everard as he will make you authenticate the orb and if it's fake you'll be thrown in jail. So give him the real orb and you'll be rewarded with 12,000 gold and the ring of Skullduggery. Now you can take the fake orb to Offulv and he will reward you with 3,000 gold and an elite camping kit. Guys, that's how to find the Jedi Orb and complete the quest line to receive both sets of rewards. Like and subscribe for more Dragon's Dogma 2 guides, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye. Farewell. I fear we have done Sir Offal the non-kindness.